So I've always seen these on like Amazon and stuff, and I never know if it's good or not. So we're gonna try the Ace Pal today. All right, let's open it up first. Okay, it seems pretty simple. I do like how it's pretty much ready to go out of the package. That's a plus. So let's put this on for, oh, it's really strong Velcro. Assume the band has to be in front of me because that would make more sense. So, uh, and I'm right-handed, so I put it on my right-hand side, which also makes sense. Looks like this holds the ball and there is a Velcro here. So let's put a volleyball in there. Okay, so not too hard to put on. You know, I think if you use this more, it'd be faster, but for my first time trying it, pretty good. Ace pal. So I guess the advantage of this is that you can hit the ball and then it'll come back to you. So you don't have to get it. And it does that. I wonder how this would be for passing. Honestly, not great for passing. I feel like you'd better just pass in the ball like without the string. And let's test it out for setting. Honestly, I can see this being pretty decent for setting in your house, especially because the issue I have in my house is I can't set as hard as I can. But with this, I can set as far as I can set it. And it only goes a little bit and comes back to me. So I can see this being a good tool to practice your outside setting from home. Let's see how a right side set looks. I would imagine it would have to go to your left. That doesn't feel great. Maybe if I put it behind me already. Nah, the string gets in the way. <laughs> okay, well, for setting, it's good for setting forward as far as you can. Hitting wise and serving wise, I'm gonna test it out right now too. So let's go for a serve. I'm just gonna aim as far as I can here. Not bad. Again, I can see this being a pretty good tool to use at home to serve as far as you can, assuming you don't have downstairs neighbors. And let's try for just like hitting down balls. Pretty good. Ooh. So again, also pretty good for hitting down balls at home or outside, assuming you don't have downstairs neighbors. And the ball stays on no matter how hard I pretty much hit it. So overall, I think this type of tool, maybe not this, this brand necessarily, can be good for volleyball players to practice at home because you can work on maximum output of your set and your serve and your hit going forwards. By the way, I'm not sponsored by Ace Pal or anything like that. Like I literally just bought this to try it. It's good, but it has its limitations. Honestly, I've seen equipment like this since I was in high school, which was in 2008. And the technology for volleyball training equipment hasn't really changed much. I feel like there's improvements that can be made, but no one's really making them. So maybe I should make them.